It's a thermostat from 2002 Mazda B 2300 Ford Ranger 2.3 liters. Uh, from 2001 to 2003, I believe they came out with these electric uh, thermostats, which are fairly expensive. They're about 150 bucks, maybe 120 if you find somewhere else online. Um, trying to benchmark test these uh, these thermostats. So this is an old one that I removed before. And from what I understand, this thing in the center is a heating element. And this goes in here. And as and then the plug connector goes inside of here. This all this does is provide power to heat that up. And then the spring, you know, uh, either opens the thermostat or closes the thermostat, depending. So what I did is I uh, provided the battery power from the battery of the truck to here and waited a few minutes and uh, noticed that this actually heated up like it's supposed to. So I guess that tells me that this thermostat is working properly. I'm not sure how hot it's supposed to get, but it was hot enough where I can touch it and um, didn't burn me. Voltage, which heats up this element here, and you can touch it and it's hot. So that tells me that the thermostat, well, at least I'm assuming the thermostat is working. I checked the plug to the truck somewhere around there, the one right there. And I was getting 13 volts to that plug. So I'm getting 13 volts to the thermostat itself. But this is not the thermostat that was installed in the truck. This is another one I had that I removed before thinking it was a problem, but now I, after bench checking this one, or I'm, I'm assuming it wasn't the problem. And all I did really was I hooked up the battery and carefully installed the uh, some alligator clips to the two pins to provide the power to the to the uh, thermostat, and that's all I did. Um, I'll show you some more as soon as I know what's going on here. Uh, what well, another thing I did is I checked the resistance between the two pins, and I got roughly uh, fourteen. 0.5 to 15 ohms and that was both when it was warm and now that it's cold and I did the same to the one that's in the truck now which uh, doesn't tell me much the resistance is the same so I'm not sure if the one in the truck is working properly or not the problem I'm having is might be a little different from what you guys are having